I see so many people that are absolutely trapped by their past. They're reliving the same story over and over and over again. They cannot move forward. The, they either look at the past as something that they've become a victim of, they were a victim of some circumstance, and they're replaying that over and over and over. Or they've looked at their failures, and they've lost a sense of self, They've allowed those failures, instead of a learning experience, the meaning that they applied to the failures were they were not good enough, they were not capable, they were not deserving. And they've applied a meaning to that past that hurts and damages the steps that they can take for a better future. See, how we feel about the past has a huge impact. Jim Rohn helped me with this early on in my career. He said, how you feel about the experiences that you've gone through and the meaning that you apply to it is going to have a huge impact on what you do in the future. Because, for me, I viewed my challenges, because, I, you know, for example, when I first started in, in network marketing, I had 18 jobs prior to that. 18 jobs before I got started in network marketing. What did that history say about me? It said that I don't finish anything. It said that I get started and then I get distracted and I move on. It said that I wasn't willing to do the work necessary in order to be successful. I wasn't willing to get better and get past that entry-level job. I wasn't willing to be disciplined enough to have success in life. That's what those 18 jobs said. And at the beginning in network marketing, I lived in that past and I had this huge amount of self-doubt that I was going to repeat the pattern. Okay, so I had to change the meaning that I had, that I had previously taught when I looked at those 18 jobs. I changed the meaning to those 18 jobs were necessary for me to find my passion. That if I became excellent, amazing at one of those 18 jobs, I might have never found the thing that allowed me to live my fullest life, this network marketing profession. Those failures, quote unquote, were necessary to open my mind to the possibilities of what network marketing might provide for me and my family and for my future. See, once I changed the meaning that I applied to that experience, I was able to now have fuel to move forward into the future. If I looked at that as that's my repeating pattern, I never finish anything, I never have any money, I never do anything, it's just like my high school experience. I barely got out of high school. C minus average. Lots of Ds, several Fs. In, in my high school experience, what would that past tell me about my future? I went to one semester of college and dropped out. What would that past tell me about my future? Unless I applied the right meaning to it, I was going to be stuck repeating this pattern over and over and over again. And some of you are stuck. Some of you are stuck with the meaning that you've applied to the past in your life. If, even in, if you've been involved in network marketing for a while, your past in network marketing might be affecting your future. You might be saying, well, you know, I, I can never get duplication. And you keep saying that over and over. That belief is not going to serve you. You might be saying, well, you know, I, I just, I get distracted too much. And I, I just, you know, I can't finish anything in network marketing. And who would follow me? I'm not a leader. You start saying that enough. Even though there's evidence that your past would, would lead you to, to that conclusion, you can change the meaning that you apply to it. And you can change it and refocus and use it now. Use the past as a school. Use it as leverage. Use it as lessons. Use it as your life experience. Use it as examples of what not to do. Use it for all the different things that you want that is positive for your belief system. You control your belief system. You control the meaning that you apply to the, act, the, the, the things that have happened in your life. And if you'll allow yourself to forgive yourself for mistakes, Understand that was part of your journey, even if it was a mistake you made yesterday. It doesn't define you. That belief does not have to define you anymore. Hey, my name is Eric Worre, and if you're involved in the network marketing profession, I want to invite you to come to the Network Marketing Pro YouTube channel. Every week, we put out content on how you can become a network marketing professional. We have tips, ideas, strategies, interviews with million dollar earners in the profession, interviews with global icons like Tony Robbins or Sir Richard Branson, lots of different things 
that we provide there absolutely free. Do yourself a favor, click on the link, subscribe to the YouTube channel, tell your friends to do the same, and I can't wait to see you there.